And get this party started. Get this party started. Okay. Let's click that play button, huh? Daniel Mullins Games. Devolver Digital. Okay. Time to figure out what's on this thing. Yes, indeed. All right. I'm going to press the any button. Okay, let's see here. New game. Wait. New game's not an option. Good start, strong start. Okay. I'm going to be completely honest here. I'm not I'm not completely in the dark about what kind of game this is. Uh, I did play Pony Island. Uh, not a whole lot of it. I mean, actually, I think a good portion of it, but we'll, we'll kind of see where this goes. So, um, there's credits. Um, let's go with continue. And it's, uh, it's a card game, so we put the card down. Okay. I love this game. Trust your modman. Absolutely. I, I, of course I do. I mean, I, I did play Pony Island. Also, Kitty, welcome. I'm glad you could join me. Another challenger. It has been ages. Okay. Perhaps you've forgotten how this game is played. Allow me to remind you. Yes, please. We got a squirrel, a stoat, and a wolf. And two wolves. <laughs> that squirrel. Play the squirrel card. Excellent. Where? I will play it here. Now, play your stoat. Oh, I see. I get it. Gonna play the stoat. Stoats cost one blood. Sacrifices must be made. Sacrifice a squirrel! An honorable death. Play the stoat. Wolves require two sacrifices. You don't have enough. Ring the bell to end your turn and commence combat. Commence combat! Your stoat stands unopposed. The number on the bottom left is the attack power. One. Your stoat dealt me one damage. I added it to the scale. You win if you tip my, my side all the way down. Ooh. Like this. Your hand's creepy, bro. Kind of terrified. A little bit. It's okay. I'm not judging. I'm just saying. Just It's throwing me off a little bit. My turn. Coyote! Your stoat stands in the way of my coyote. My coyote dealt two damage to your stoat. That means your stoat's health is two less. Oh, goodness. The creature's health reaches zero, it dies. It's my turn again, okay. You may draw from your deck or you may draw a squirrel. What? I mean, I guess I wanna draw a squirrel because I wanna sacrifice, right? How dull, of course. So, yeah, okay. So we want a squirrel, right? Okay. And we want to play a wolf. We want to sacrifice these two. Fear not, the beast is sacrificed, but not removed from your deck. Its suffering was real, but you will see it again. Oh, God. I like how the card said, what? No! <laughs> Oh, that's terrifying. Okay. And uh, that's all we can do. So we're ringing the bell. Because you are learning, I will pass. Again, the choice. A random card from your deck 
or the certainty of a squirrel? Random card. River Snapper! Can we, can we get a better... Okay. Yeah, alright. I was gonna say, can we get a better look at her cards? Because that would be nice. So one damage, but it takes... It, it's got six. Okay. Okay. Um... I should have gotten another squirrel, because sacrifices must be made. Oh. Oh, damn. Three damage dealt. Three weights on the scale. And you're going to pass again? You crazy bastard. We only had one card in our deck? Taking that squirrel. That squirrel down. How many cards can you play? Could I have played two squirrels? There's no point in me sacrificing anything. Let's go ahead and... Uh... Oh, shit! You've won this match. They won't all be so easy. Okay. Let me recall your story. Oh, yes! Oh. You were lost deep in the forest. A single path revealed itself. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> the, the art, the art is great. I love that stoat. That stoat is adorable. Why is the stoat the only one moving? Hmm. All right. So I guess we're gonna go here. <gasps> Two denizens of the forest approach you tentatively. <gasps> A cat. A gato. The undying cat. Sacrificing the poor beast does not kill it. Hmm. The Caustic Adder. Damage from its poison bite is always lethal. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, you may only you may only choose one to grace your paltry deck. If I have squirrels, why would I take the cat? That's terrifying. Whoa, what? Bifurcated strike? Trifurcated strike? My god! Frozen away. Trinket bear, can I? Oh. What's going on here? There's so many! Ants! Stinky! <laughs> oh, goodness. Car card counter? Boon of the ambidextrous! Oh, this is this is interesting. You'll start a battle with eight bones? Boon of the Bone Lord! Bone of the Boon Lord. I don't know how to Uh okay. I'm gonna I'm definitely gonna take the cat though. Harpy's bird leg fan. Taking that cat. Another creature joins your caravan! Hooray! Alright, some some of the creatures of the forest seemed willing to follow you. You came across an abandoned sack. 
You found a squirrel in a bottle. Break in case of emergency. And have a second. Nice. Another useful implement. It'll allow you to tip the scale. I'll, I'll allow you to tip the scales with it. What? Three is as much as you can carry. Why don't I take the bag? Can't use that right now. Got our gato. I'm sure this is going to be one of those things because this is kind of one of those psychological games where like there'll be something that's not okay. We'll we'll get to that part. We'll get to things. I'm sure I'll figure something out eventually. You were ambushed while crossing some rough terrain. Uh oh. There's a stump. It's like this is like Galaga right here. We put our attack devices here and and things in the way. We gotta break through them first. I'm guessing. You were ambushed while crossing some rough terrain. You sacrificed me while I was sleeping. It was the right play. I get it. Maybe. You'll help me. Play along for now. Uh-oh. You may now see my moves ahead of time. Hmm. Why do I feel like I'm going to end up as a card at some point? Let's see. Does that mean it goes back into my hand? Oh, right. It requires one sacrifice. Okay. Okay. Need I remind you? Your items may help. Hmm. Interesting. Aha! A well-earned point of damage! <laughs> oh my god! Is the is that a tooth right there? What is going on? I love this. I didn't think you would really do it. Well, bro, I don't know what to tell you about that. All right, let's put a squirrel down. Yeah, wolf cub coming up. I'll put my squirrel down. How do you feel about that? Can I play another squirrel? I can play another squirrel. I'm gonna do that. I'm guessing I can play as many as I can handle right now. So I'm on. I'm on. Can I not sacrifice these? Oh right, I, I gotta, gotta play it, and then I sacrifice. Does kind of explain why this is the only animated card, because it is talking to me. That is an adorable cat, and I love it. Okay, um, get that red snapper in there. Sacrifice these two. Put it here. Then I'm gonna I'm gonna get that cat out. Put it right there. For no good reason, now that I'm thinking about it. That was a terrible play. <laughs> but I don't know how to play this game, so that's where we at. But you know what? Let's try. See what happens here. <gasps> oh. Maybe that was actually the best play that I could I could do. Because nothing can go there, right? Here we go. That's me, baby. Mind the ambitious wolf cub. It ages swiftly. Uh-oh. What the F? No, we're going to... We're gonna find that. We're gonna see what that.
There's so many. There's so many. Fledgling, a card bearing the sigil will grow into a more powerful form after one turn on the board. Uh oh. Uh oh. Apparently, I could have just looked it up. All right. I'm terrified. Okay, well, and there's a bat coming in. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um. We got, what, two wolves coming up? Coming up. Coming up. Um. Get a wolf. <laughs> I feel really bad for sacrificing the stoat already, but this is basically this is where we at. This is where we at. Wow, seriously? <laughs> All right. Yeah, we doing it. Okay, we got that bat. The airborne bat flies over creature to attacks to attack directly. Okay, so got it, got it, got it. Now, ha! My bat bat flew right over your river snapper. You you choik. Oh, it's even flappy. Look at that. That's fun. Kind of want to put the. Uh... Can I punch someone? That would be great. Um, let's see here. I mean, I'll, I guess I'll draw a squirrel. I don't really need anything... ...as yet. Now, here's the question. Does the does the bat take damage? Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Nice. And I think if we just go again... Wait a second. What... Oh, and that's just to show me where I'm at? Okay. Interesting. I... I will draw another. Oh, well, yeah, I'll put a squirrel down and then we'll, um... Beautiful. And we'll go ahead. confused. It looks like extra things are going into some thing that this person has like some receptacle of sorts. I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, you prevailed and trekked onward past the now bloodied terrain. This is fun. This is fun. This is a good time. I feel like I shouldn't be playing when it's like this bright out, but whatever. Um, the young wolf cub. It grows into a wolf after a single turn. The meek sparrow, an inexpensive, if feeble, flying creature. I see the cost is the same. I want a flying one. <laughs> so creepy. <laughs> this is so adorable. I love this. Okay. All right. Let's let's move on here. What's going on here? What do we got here? You stumbled into some strange stones in the mist. Okay. I'll get it soon. Of course I will. Of course I will. It's. I feel like this is gonna be one of those things where it's like I'm gonna I'm gonna because because I, I kind of know the type of game. I'll start learning these rules and then they'll just kind of maybe yeah um you've stumbled into some strange stones in the mist okay you were compelled to choose a worthy sacrifice one that will be lost forever oh god oh no okay oh not the kitty I like the kitty I don't care about the sparrow you pick me 
You looked upon your menagerie and selected a healthy host. I mean, of course I'm gonna pick the one that says pick me. That just, that's obvious. That is obvious. This is interesting. Is it always... It always opens to this page, too. Hmm. That's interesting. Okay. So, of course I'm going to pick you, bro. You're the you're the you're the stoat. All right, let us continue. <laughs> what an honor. Oh shit. You're a flying stoat now? A ghastly spectacle. But the soul of the sparrow now lives in the stoat. I like this. This is nice. This is fun. Let's see what's going on over here. I knew- see, I- I was worried for other reasons, because the other game, the Pony Island, I played that with someone else that, um... Yeah, I was worried I might not be able to get into this, and I'm getting into it, so we're good. Uh, behold my totem! It inscribes my canine cards with the airborne sim sigil. I don't like that! He's completely insane. You see that, right? No care for the rules. Pathetic, really. Enough! Only keeps me around to watch me suffer. I'm gonna have to give him a different voice. I have to, so... He's got glowy eyes. It's getting creepy up in this bitch. It's getting a little creepy. But for real, is that a tooth right there? I feel like that's a tooth. Could I have used the those, um... Uh... Yeah, alright. Um. So what we got coming up? We got a flying coyote and a flying bat. Okay, um, problematic. Okay, okay. Play a squirrel. Then we will play a cat. And then we will... Let's see... Do they attack each other in the air if they're flying? That's the question. Or do they do they bypass? <laughs> Back on the board. All right. Yeah. So that's that's what I can do right now. Let's see what happens. Oh right, <laughs> they hadn't been played yet. I knew that. I, wait, how come you can play two? Without sacrificing. Oh, I suppose because you can do it if you can play the cards. If you can do it all in one turn, they don't have to show that part. Unless the whole thing about not following the rules is... Anyway, my totem has get, uh, granted my coyote the power of flight. Well, shit. That's... that's... That's a problem. Okay, so I'm going to take a squirrel so I can sacrifice... Huh. This symbol right here, does that... It must signify that it's a canine. Okay. Um, that's what we can do. So that's what we'll do. I... This is... I'm scared. I'm scared I might get... I might get killed. I shouldn't have put the stoat there. I should have put something that can damage. Can I... I wish I could move things around here. That's alright. Um... It's not like I could play anything anyway. I'm gonna have to get another. Oh no! No, not my kitty! Oh wait, it's flying. It bypasses. I knew that. I knew that. Need another squirrel. Oh! 
Oh, okay. That's one sacrifice, and then the squirrel. Okay, cool. Cool. I got it. I figured it out. Figured it out. Okay. You're one damage away from winning. What do we got? We got we got, we got wolves. We got a gato. That's there's a flying punk there. We have a snapper. We can't really do anything with it anyway. So that's that's fine. It's fine. Get dealt with punk. I don't think there was really any strategy involved in that. That was just like throwing cards into the spokes and hoping they. Do it. Impressive. You may yet survive this ordeal. Knock on wood. All right. We're getting some new cars here. Cards here. Let's see. Oh, there's three of them. Oh, the, the conniving raven. A blight upon the skies. Very nice. A sparrow. We got. We know that one. This one takes two. Does two damage though. I do like that. The flighty elk. It moves after attacking. Ooh. Ooh. Flelk. I mean, I've got a flying creature already. Even though the raven is nice, I want the flelk. Okay, so we got two ways we can go. This is the upgrade sacrifice way. This is the campfire way. I don't know what that means. Let's take a look. What is their items? All right, let's see what the campfire is. I ain't never done that before. Oh, goodness. You came across a small group of survivors. What have they been surviving? Faces shrunken from starvation, they huddle around a campfire. They looked upon your group of creatures and beckoned. Come warm one of your creatures by the fire, one said. Warm it by the fire. That will enhance its power, said another. You noticed one of the survivals wiping drool from their mouth. Uh-huh. After this intro game is over, I'll, I'll, I'll get it more. <laughs> Thanks for the heads up. I, I, I like it already. I mean, it's still... Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. I feel like someone gonna get eaten up in this. Yon River Snapper can take a lot of hits. But don't do much damage. And the Gato. And we love the Gato. I'm gonna put that river snapper. Y'all gonna eat my river snapper, aren't you? I was wrong. It now does more damage. The fire warmed the poor river snapper, enhancing its power. One of the survivors reached toward it. Another gnashed their teeth. Without a word, you pulled the river snapper away from the fire and left. Yeah, yeah, that seemed like a good idea. Seemed like a good plan. Oh, what the what? There's a way out for both of us. It's somewhere in this foul cabin. Be silent or I will tear you to shreds. What, what, did, what did it say? What's it, what's it say there? Oh, is it just dot, dot, dot? I'm guessing it's just dot, dot, dot. Okay. We got ourselves a squirrel. Grand fur. Oh, flying creatures can't. Okay. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm 
Hmm. Hmm. Do I want to play the stoat already? Oh, I can use a scroll. Awesome. Play the stoat already, or... Wait until we get another squirrel and we can play something else. But I think we can only play... And eh, let's stoat it up. This spot? You sure? Uh... It's too late now, isn't it? Yeah, take one damage, you punk. I was not sure. This is a bad plan. This is a very bad plan. Let's see, two, four. This one would survive a grizzly attack. But it'll do some damage and take a hit, so... Damn it, can I sacrifice someone else? I would like to. I would like to sacrifice it. I don't want to sacrifice my stoat. Yet. Here we are. Oh hell. Well, that's a problem. I don't think there's any way I... Yeah. You've lost. Using this as a learning opportunity may be the only way to mitigate my disappointment. Get up. Get up from the table. Fetch me the candlestick from atop the barrel beside the door. Okay. Okay, there's stuff. I can look at the clock. Oh man. Now I just have to remember what the uh what the time you need to set the clock to in Final Fantasy 6 to get the chainsaw is. It's like 3:15 or something. Wait a second, there are 3 Wait, oh yeah, seconds. <laughs> Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I got it. I figured it out. Okay. Yeah, I don't remember what time it was. Um. Creepy. Creepy. Just a... Just a creepy thing here. Okay. What do we got here? We got a, a safe with multiple things. We've got some fun little guys here. It's very dark. A dagger. I'm, of course, I'm gonna get it. I'm just, I'm gonna not do it right now. Obviously. Okay. Feel like that's upside down. That's locked. Huh. Interesting. I don't know. How's the... How's... <laughs> See, told... To, yeah, you did tell me. You did. You did indeed. You told me I would enjoy it more. That's fair. How's the gamma on this, by the way? Like, how, how, is everyone else seeing this all right? Bring it here. Aw, oh, man, it doesn't give me more light. Dumb. That creepy hand, though. The darks are very dark, but it looks good. Shit, because I, I can muck with the, um... 
I can muck with the uh, gamma. Uh, that's a little bit. Uh, how's that work? Is that a little better? Let's see. I'll, uh, I'll, we'll try that for a little bit. Also, sound I haven't done. It's not too loud, is it? It's better? Okay, cool. Alright, let's, let's continue with our, uh, our shroud. Now sit back down. Um, okay. Sure, why not? Let me explain something to you. That was one of the two mistakes you can make here. If you make another, I must sacrifice you. Uh, now, where were we? What mistake did I make? Let's go this way. Get ourselves a new card. Are those mushrooms? Are those mushrooms? What's going on here? Oh, are those are those just showing that we already have one? They do appear to be mushrooms, though. I'm a little disturbed. Let's take a look at this backpack see what we can get there. A rock may get you out of a hard place. A tooth puller. Okay, 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 okay. You will place a weight on the scale. The pain is temperate. I wonder if you can only use those 26 times or, or however many, uh, is it 26? No, it's not 26. How many? Why do I not know how many teeth are in the human mouth? <laughs> I feel like I should know that. Can you, can you make cut up one of your adversary's cards? It is destroyed. Um. Oh goodness, I like this. This is fun. I will. You know, what the hell? I'll take the boulder. It's bleeding yields three blood. If you can ignore the bleeding. <laughs> a gust from this may lift your creatures into the air, if only for a turn. A powerful item. Turn this and I'll skip my next turn. I mean, yeah! Feeling overburdened with an, uh, enough with a full three items you carried on. I guess so! Oh no, is this a boss? This looks like a boss. Oh! Creepy. The trees seem to close in around you as a chill mist descended. In the distance, you could hear the clinking of metal on stone. A hobbled figure, figure stood there, stood in your path. <gasps> Pee-haw! Twas the prospector! I'm scarified. Oh, we got a boulder for free. A pack mule! What's the point of it? Oh. Okay. V. 
very confused. Very confused. You, you're kind of freaking me out, bro. Um, let's see. We've got a gato, a squirrel. We want to put it out of the way. Let's see. I think... Because it doesn't look like I can use... Right. Yeah, let's just get ourselves a boulder. Just put that down in the way of any damage incoming. And, uh... I guess we gonna pass then. Um, let's see. Ein Squirrel? What? Oh. Okay. You kind of just change directions. Okay, cool. Yes, good. Good. Yes. Oh. You're going to take all that damage, just... What is under this? What are... Un you know what? Does it matter? Let's just figure it out. Let's move along. Oh, no! Oh, my boulders are going away now! That's a problem. Um, I will get a squirrel, because this boulder is going to go away next turn. And then we'll be able to play our elk friend! Dag nabbit, my mule. D see, is this is this creepy narrator voice or is it a uh, prospector voice? I think it's I think it's I think it's prospector voice or uh, uh, narrator. Did I neglect to mention overkill damage? Excess damage is not wasted. It carries over to the card behind the mangled corpse of the victim. Oh, scary. Lucky for you. Oh shit, we got prob we got problems here. All right, let's uh, cause we got a couple squirrels. Let's draw a raven here. Okay, 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 okay. Once a card bearing the sigil is struck, the striker is then dealt a single point of damage. What about a skunk? It's stinky, right. Ah, the creature opposing a card bearing the sigil loses one power. Well, that's... Actually sort of helpful. Could prevent, uh... Prevent a hit. Actually, let's do the porcupine. Yes, it is good. Thought that through very differently. I was like, oh yeah, the porcupine can attack. Boulders are like protection and shit, good but less spaces for cards. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm feeling that. I'm definitely feeling that. Um Did I not draw I didn't draw a card yet, okay. We've got two squirrels, let's get another. He's doing the prospector again? Easy boss. The mule is key. Wait, what? Mule? Interesting. Very interesting.
I mean, I don't necessarily... Actually, that's too late. It's too late now. Um... Yes. Yes. And then when we attack, we'll take out that wolf. Let's see if we can... Can I... Let's see. Aha! Excellent. That makes that, 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 that undying thing even more... It's mo better. Alright, so... This dude. This dude's face is terrifying. I love it. Okay. Um... I don't really think we have to do anything. Just damage. <gasps> I hope you didn't think it would be that easy. There's gold in them cards. Oh shit. That is not okay. G -g gold I've struck gold You dick You dick Okay I do I do I actually can I You're out of space There's no room for that card Okay I guess I just have to wait for you to tunnel on through. That kind of... Get him! Bloodhound. That's just... That's frustrating. What do I got? What do I got? What do I got? Two damage. What is this? Let's see here. Guardian. When an opposing creature is placed opposite to an empty space, the card bearing the sigil will move to that empty space. Okay. 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 So, move to intercept, essentially. Let's see. What have we got here? Got another squirrel. We got a stove. And uh, we got ourselves a skunk. I want to do damage, and that is problematic. Because I cannot. Hmm. Because this would just prolong it for several turns, unless you put other creatures out. And this would get killed into and not do any damage to the, uh, the beast. And I can't put this one down. Um, you know what? We can prolong what we've got and maybe sacrifice it uh, later on if we need to. There we go. There we go. Okay. We've only got one card left. Another wolf. Okay. Okay. All right. Guess this is what we're doing. Take ourselves a squirrel. Down a squirrel. Ha! Ah, can't move, can you? Ha! And let's see. Want the river. Definitely want to put it here.
Let's see, let's see. Yeah, what the hell? Okay. Oh, another adder? Well, that's terrible! Okay, um... I want to get rid of that that hound. I could sacrifice both of these. Ack! Yeah, that's what we'll do. I'm not gonna put the squirrel down though. Ain't no point in that. Okay, now we gotta get another squirrel. Oh shit! This is not. I wonder if that's- is that gonna kill me instantly? Cause that would not be good. That would be, in fact, bad. I'm gonna wait- I'm gonna wait until I get another turn here. We get two squirrels. I'm gonna see- let's see if we get killed. No. Okay, cool. Alright, so, um... we can do... is... put that there, and then we can soak up a little damage from that squirrel! For, for, with that squirrel! Now I'm gonna get turned into gold again, aren't I? Yes! Allow me to light your candles once more. I won't be killing you quite yet. Oh, so that's how many lives I have. I understand. You're the first in a while to, come up to overcome a boss. As a reward, you are granted an opportunity to select a rare card. Choose carefully. I'm afraid. Largely an impressive specimen. Strange larva, huh? Well, what does it turn into? You're a Yuli? This level of brutish strength needs no explanation. Holy God, that's a lot. Okay. Gek. An uninspired, the uninspiring Gek. Perhaps you can find a use for it. I mean... It doesn't cost any... I want to get the strange larva. I'm going to get the strange larva. I want to see what it grows into. With the sound of the prospector's pickaxe still ringing in your ears, you carried onwards. Onward! Hmm. Oh, got kind of greenish. The rank smell of rot and mold permeated the humid, humid air. Every step forward was answered by some nearby slip or slither. You tread clush. You tread cautiously, cautiously into the wetlands. Oh my god, my... My mouth just ain't working right now. The wetlands. The stalwart snapper. A near, a near impenetrable defense. I mean... Okay, yep. The 
Feathered Mantis, its prying claws strike both to the left and the right and right. Oh, interesting. That is, that sounds very interesting. The apothecized goat. Apotheosa. What word is that even? <laughs> the truest offering. Sacrificing, gra it grants three blood. In the, if you get items in the item jar, do you keep those? Is that like... Do you just, overall, do you just keep them? Take that mantis. All right, now which way am I gonna go? See if we can increase the stoat's power. You can keep three, I think, at a time, but you can use them whenever. So the question is, after you use them and then you have the card, do you keep the card after? And maybe you can upgrade it? You're not sure? That's fair. Ooh. Ooh. There it is. Sorry. A little, uh, little neck crack in there. Um... We can only keep like three items, so I'm not gonna bother going to get this. What I want to do is, you believe so? Okay, cool. I think that I will go toward the fire and we'll see if we can upgrade the stoat. A group of survive the starving survivors stood around a dying campfire. There is room for a creature around the fire, one said. The warmth will enhance its power, said another. One of the survivors said nothing at all, but could not stop licking their lips. No way. So you don't want me to do it. Okay. Okay, my dude. Wow, it's actually a different color. Interesting. Um... So let's let's try the snapper. Wait, did we we upgraded this snapper already? Hmm. The power of the river snapper was enhanced by the warmth. As one of the survivors began pulling a knife from their pocket, you withdrew. Oh, uh, that sounds scary. Hey, it's creepy. What's all this then? Oh no! All all them. It's me. I'm guessing that this gives all your birds uh, the ability to block flight. That is frustrating. Um, let's see. Um, Kingfisher, what the flip? What does that mean? What's all this? Waterborne, a, a card bearing the sigil, submerges itself during its opponent's turn. While submerged, opposing creatures attack its owner directly. Oh. Oh. So I can't kill those. Well, shit. Um, hmm. Oh, damn it, I did this all wrong. Um, doesn't really matter. 